Hello everyone, J Aquatics here, and today we'll be taking a quick first look at my aquariums. Starting with the 35 Gaddon. This aquarium has one low and largemouth bass. The substrate is natural and the drifter we collected ourselves. The largemouth bass is the only fish in this aquarium because it's an aggressive fish. We caught him locally from our lake, but we're, we might plan to put some sunfish in the tank in the near future. It's a standard filter, standard heater, and a 35 gallon aquarium. He'll be happy here for another year or so before we upgrade before we have to upgrade him to a bigger tank. He's about three to four inches, and we feed him freeze-dried plankton, blood worms, wax worms, earthworms, even insects from our backyard, and feeder fish. He seems pretty happy with the tank, and we'd be happy to get him some tank mates as well. This is it for this tank. It's a 35 gallon. Let's get on to the other one. The next tank is a 25 gallon community tank, and there are big changes coming for this one. We're moving all the guppies out of here, and we're going to make this an all Asian tank. So far, in terms of Asian fish, we have a Siamese algae eater, three cherry barbs, one male and two females, and three cherry shrimp, all females. For the cherry shrimp, I'm hoping to get males so they could, they could start breeding in the tank and I could distribute them without, throughout all my tanks. There are lots of guppy fry in here, but they'll all be moving to different separate tanks. I have two 10 gallons upstairs that I'll be moving the guppies into so I could start selectively breeding them. So this is it for this tank. As I mentioned, there are some cherry shrimp in here. Um, I'm trying to get the males so they could start breeding, and I want to distribute the cherry shrimp throughout all my tanks except for the bass aquarium. The fry, there's plenty of them, and they'll be growing up pretty soon. I'm already moving some of the bigger ones in with the females. And there are also snails in most of my aquariums. That's it for the day. See you next time on J Aquatics.